I mean, correct me if I'm wrong, but wasn't this 1,000 COD points and all of a sudden these money-hungry sons of bitches made it 2,000 COD points? Are they serious? Y'all niggas is really cheeks. But you lost, though. <laughs> oh, yeah, niggas trash. But you lost, though. <laughs> I gotta do it. I gotta do it. Yes, nigga. Bro, so you lost the trash, niggas? Nigga, nigga, yo, I would have bitch if I would have came. <laughs> I don't understand why he was don't saying that we was trash. You lost the trash. That's what you're saying. You lost the trash. Oh my god, I came in so late and still came back. Niggas. Bro, how'd you come back if you lost? It doesn't make sense. I dropped 33. Oh I was god, the top yeah. player in the lobby. I don't understand, brother. All right, what is going on guys? How do you do? It's your boy Gray here. Welcome back to the channel, man. In today's video, as you guys can see, the ICR7 bundle is available right now for PlayStation console players uh, for the PlayStation Call of Duty Black Ops 4 community here. The ICR7 bundle. So it includes uh, 10 reserve crates. Uh, so that's, that's all right. 10 reserve crates right there. An ICR7 Mark II signature weapon, which before it was known as Bounding Glory, if I remember correctly. Uh, the Summon uh, Monster Craft Camo, which had a different name before as well, but now it's called the Summon Mon uh, Master, Master Craft Camo. And also the Skull Cracker Reactive Camo, all available here for the ICR7. Now, if you guys don't know about this right here, this was actually available in the very first operation that Black Ops 4 had. When Black Ops 4 came out, the first operation, I think it was called Operation First Strike or something like that. Level 100, the level, no, the tier 200, excuse me, the tier 200 was actually this right here, the Bounding Glory, uh, or as it's known now, the Mark II variant of the ICR-7, the signature weapon. Um, yeah, this was the level 200, and I believe throughout the rest of the tiers, but between 1 through 200, you can unlock like the, the uh, Mastercraft camo as well as the reactive camo for the ICR-7. And now it's available in the black market, in the blackjack shop. It's available as a bundle for 2,000 COD points. And I got to tell you guys, man, I thought, I thought about this before and I was thinking about during the live stream earlier today, I was thinking about how they basically put out one melee weapon. The, uh, the little sledgehammer thing, whatever it's called. They put out the sledgehammer, uh, the melee weapon for 3,000 COD points. That's $30 for just for one, just for one melee weapon and like two other things that make absolutely no sense and have no impact in the game at all. Now we're getting, we're getting basically a signature variant, a Mastercraft camel and a reactive camel plus 10 tiers for 2,000 COD points. And I was like, you know, during the live stream, I was saying like, man, that's pretty, that's a good deal. That's $20 for all of this right here. That's a good deal. And then I just caught, I caught myself just like after the stream, I caught myself and I'm like, damn, this is what Treyarch is doing to us. Like they're, they're giving us absurd deals, absurd bundles, special offers, sarcastic quotations. They're giving us all of these special offers here. And they're really making us think that they're giving us something that's worth the money or worth the COD points. Be told, 1,000 COD points, which is what this was originally, 1,000 COD points for this right here, for this bundle, perfect. The, I would 100%, I would give all my COD points, 1,000 COD points for this right here, 100%. $2,020, so $20. The game right now in the PlayStation Store at this very moment, it is right now I'm recording this at 12.08, uh, 12.08 a.m., on April 12th, 2019, at this very moment in the PlayStation Store, the BO4, the game itself, I believe, cost $25. Actually, have it on sale for in the PSN Store for $25. This bundle right here, which is a great bundle, don't get me wrong, it's a great bundle, but you're telling me this costs $20? Once again, man, I'm not knocking it. It's a great bundle. I think, honestly, the ICR-7, great weapon, signature variant. Uh, you get that Mark II, you get that extra kills. What is it, 25% extra kills per XP? Yeah, 25% extra XP per kill. Great. It's a it's a great, you know, introduction, bundle, whatever it is for the ICR-7. It's great, plus 10 tiers. You might be able to unlock something else within those 10 tiers. Who knows? The title of this video is, is it worth it? Is it worth it? In my opinion, would I give $20 for this bundle? 
Honestly, I don't think I would. As a content creator, I probably would buy it if I didn't have, if I didn't already didn't have all this stuff, I probably would buy it and I would make a video for you guys as a content creator because it's part of my job. But as a regular player, as somebody who doesn't create content, as somebody who just plays this game, would I give $20 for this? Honestly, I really wouldn't. Would I give $10? Definitely. I would definitely give $10 for this right here. This is a great deal for $10. To start things off, I just want to show you guys a few things that are in the bundle. And once again, I actually already have all of the items in the bundle, not because I purchased it, but because I completed the first operation, the operation first strike uh, that was available to us. I completed the 200 tiers and I unlocked all these things in the past for free. You guys can see right here, man, this is the ICR-7. This right here is the uh, Mark II variant of the uh, ICR-7. Once again, ICR-7, you guys can see that's what it looks like right there. And here is the Mark II variant of the ICR-7, formerly known as Bounding Glory, if I remember correctly. Up that off here, man. Something that I've had for a while here is the Skull Cracker Reactive Camo. Um, to show you guys the detail of this thing, at the start of the game, it kind of just looks like that. Uh, just a bunch of skulls on there. Uh, this is a little different to react. This reactive camo is a little different. It, it's based off of headshots. Uh, at three headshots, you guys can see that the eyes kind of start to glow on the weapon. You guys can see that glow right there on the on the skeleton on this on the uh, eye on, on the eyes and everything like that. Why why am I fumbling my words here? Uh, at six headshots, you start to see the lines crossing through and everything, and then they glows even more. Pretty pretty cool. I'm not gonna lie, it looks pretty cool. But once again, it is based off of headshots. And then taking a look here, in my opinion, maybe one of the best Mastercraft camels as far as the glow and the design and the illustration that it has. The Mastercraft camel, which now is called Summon. Summon. I, I believe before I had a different name. Maybe I'm maybe I'm mistaken. Not really. You know, to show you guys what this Mastercraft camel here it is, man. At the start of the game, it just looks like this. Really cool. By itself, it looks really awesome, man. It's just really, really good looking camo. At five kills, uh, at five kills, you get a little bit of a heavier green glow to it right around the middle area you guys can see and at 10 kills you get this little uh it, it changes like to an orange red orange kind of a glow uh and you get the yellow on it and stuff like that it's pretty cool i'm not gonna lie uh, i mean i'll leave it completely up to you guys in my opinion i don't think it's worth it but i will say it is a good deal it, it does give uh stuff that people would want and would be able to use out in the field uh way more than a melee weapon in my opinion um in today's video guys i just want to show you a little bit of class setup using a mark ii variant in about it now maybe i should have played with the mastercraft camo but or whatever man i already i already got the gameplay footage that i wanted for the uh for this video here so i am going to be running in this video you guys are going to see me run the icr7 mark ii variant here um the class setup that i was running i actually like the threat detector for some reason i've always liked the threat detector on the icr7 grip one grip two turns it into a complete laser absolutely zero recoil love running grip one and grip two on the icr7 and long barrel here you guys the long barrel attachment just to extend that damage range salvo launcher is our secondary here stim shot as our gear perk one scavenger perk number three dead silence and then the primary gunfighter for that third attachment right there that is the class setup definitely try it out for you for, for yourselves i usually always run my icr7 in this fashion in this matter uh every once in a while maybe i'll take off the the optic maybe i'll throw on something else maybe i'll go iron sight maybe i'll you know throw on a perk number two there or something like that it's completely you know however i'm feeling but that's how i ran it in today's video you guys are gonna see some really fun gameplay and i believe it was gridlock if i remember correctly uh pretty pretty fun gameplay there you dropped the 30 something bomb and uh yeah man let me know what you guys think in the comment section below um if you weren't able to unlock this during the first operation and you are thinking about buying the bundle let me know in the comment section below if you guys ended up purchasing the bundle if you guys think it's worth it let me know in the comment section below man let's have a conversation and see what you guys think because i, I at first i was like oh man this is a good deal and then i realized that's what treyarch wants man this is why they've been giving us all these incredibly like expensive bundles and incredibly stupid and expensive things in the game um like the melee weapon for 30 dollars just so that when they give us stuff like this for 20 dollars we think oh man that's a good deal when in reality it's expensive that's still expensive this this bundle should be max ten dollars let me know what you guys think in the comment section below man i hope you guys enjoy the rest of the video and the gameplay thank you so much for watching i'm back out of here till the next one my name is gray oh almost forgot almost forgot subscribe if you're new turn on notifications and drop a like hit that thumbs up for me let's aim for 100 plus likes on today's video once again thank you so much i'm gonna back out of here till the next one my name is gray peace Two stores open Okay. Alright, man. 14 11 here. They just threw me into this game, you guys. You guys can see I got two kills right there. Those are my first two kills. Says they're going and uh, here we go. Just give me some laser, bro. I'll give it that. Okay. 
back up. Two backs, two backs over here. Come on. Me, me, me. I should have died there because I got hesitated. Oh, I hesitated on that. Here we go. Anti UAV. Okay. Come on, dude. I know you're right there, man. Look at this shit. He's right there. Oh, oh. oh dude. My tactical button layout almost screwed me there. Okay. Okay. Uh -huh. Okay. Right under. Okay. Yo, oh, baby, ICR is putting in work right now. I'm not gonna lie to you guys. Like, the signature variant right now of the ICR, the uh, bound or whatever, the, the Mark II of the of the ICR, you guys can see right here. It's a dope gun, and the ICR is just a it's a very reliable weapon. But yeah, you, you guys are reading the wrong time. Say here, ah, he got me. Good, good kill, good kill. I didn't expect anybody to be behind me there. The laser, let's go, baby. Get me out of there. Oof. Starting engagement. Oh, the ra the rampart, the rampart. Of course, of course, the rampart. What other weapon would melt me like that? I want this guy. I want the torque. Oh, he's in the window. He's in the window. Come on, buddy. I'm not even gonna heal. Oh, I should have healed. Enemy UAV above. <laughs> I got it. Enemy CUAV established above. Okay. Ready to crack. Okay. Good. Ah, dog behind me freaked me out. No, no, you kill me, you kill me, bro. You gotta kill me, man. Just headshot there. Nope, not like this. Not like that, buddy. Hey, how did you not kill me there? What the hell? The hell? How did they not kill me there? Anyways, man, 33 and 9. Did you really come back because you lost? Y'all niggas is really cheeks. But you lost, though. Oh, yeah, niggas trash. But you lost, though. I gotta do it. I gotta do it. Bro, so you lost the trash, niggas? Yo, I would have bitch if I would have came. <laughs> I don't understand why he was saying that we was trash. You lost the trash. That's what you're saying. You lost the trash. Oh my god! I came in so late and still came back. Niggas, bro, how'd you come back if you lost? It doesn't make sense. I dropped 33. I was the top player in the lobby. I don't understand, brother.